This week, 356 new stalls were installed throughout the United States and Canada, bringing the total stall count to 59,989. BP Pulse added two stations. Mercedes-Benz Charging Hub added one. Pilot Flying J added one. Tesla added 19. ChargePoint added 19 as well. EVgo added three. EVConnect added six. Let's get into the data. First, BP Pulse added a Thornton's in Aurora, Illinois, and a BP gas station in Clearwater, Florida, both four stalls. Mercedes-Benz added one in Wharton, Texas. Ironically enough, I just did a Mercedes-Benz charging hub update last night, and there's a new one in Texas that was not on that update. So this will be in the eventual next update with Mercedes-Benz at some point, I'm guessing in February. Pilot Flying J added one, Good Hope, Alabama, four stalls. Here's Tesla. They were uh, a little bit slower last time, but if you look at the open dates, they go back all the way to December 11th. So it looks like they were doing some data cleanup. A lot of these are clustered around the uh, tail end of the month, but some of them were in the middle of the month. And only one, which my head is blocking, let me undo that. One was in January, so it looks like, you know, they broke for holiday vacation, and when they came back, they cleaned up the data and proceeded on. They really don't take um, winter breaks like some of the other CPOs I see, like Pilot Flying J normally takes a winter break, it seems. We'll see if they do that this year or not. Uh, but the numbers overall generally are slower, and it looks like uh, this is... Um, being uh, seen in the Tesla numbers as well. A couple of things to call out. Some really large ones, Oceanside, California had a 20 stall and two more 20 stalls, uh, both in British Columbia down here. There's a 19 stall, which is very likely a 20 stall with one of them just out of commission at a Bucky's in Athens, Alabama. And otherwise Tesla just showing who the boss is, which is Tesla Supercharger right now. Charge point, I did do coalescing, and you can see this uh, Ford dealership in Buena Park, California has six stalls. The uh, Guam, Massachusetts has four stalls. Not quite sure what that is, if it's a car dealership or what, but four stalls. Otherwise, charge point continuing on their conquest mission. Evigo added three, two eight stalls in California, one in Santa Maria and another one in Hesperia. And Orlando, Florida got a brand new six stall station. Very interesting. I really like EVgo because their data is always consistent. None of this like what Tesla does where they do them in batches. As they open stations, they put them into the database and I'm suspecting it's automated just from the cadence that they keep with adding stations is very regular. And I really like EVgo's entries into the database here. And here's EV Connect. Um, very similar, they, their cadence is always right on. If you look at the dates, they're always very current. And usual suspects of General Motors branded car dealerships with the exception of the Ford dealership in Kissimmee, Florida. Thanks for watching.